Hey guys, today we are going to take a sneak peek at the FPS mouse in the market. So if you're planning to buy one, then you are at the right place. Please do check out the description below and see all the featured products and their buy link. Let's get started. Best overall, Razer Death Adder Elite. The Razer Death Adder Elite is a good gaming mouse that follows the Death Adder design from previous years. It's excellent for right-handed people looking for a mouse with fantastic performance and setting options. It has a sleek gaming design and fits almost every hand size and grip without overdoing it. Unfortunately, people with smaller hands might have an awkward hand posture when using the claw or fingertip grip. Nevertheless, this wired mouse has low latency, great for gamers, but the cable is relatively rigid. The Razer Death Adder Elite is a very well-built gaming mouse. It's made of solid plastic and there are no wobbling parts. The mouse feels slightly loose than the Mamba Elite since the Death Adder can't tilt its mouse wheel. But this is a minor difference. Its feet are relatively good and glide well. Best Wireless Razer Viper Ultimate The Razer Viper Ultimate is a fantastic gaming mouse that's very versatile and handles anything you throw at. Its performance is excellent and the latency is extremely low, whether you use it wired or wirelessly. It has an ambidextrous design with two side buttons on each side, giving you plenty of programmable options. It feels durable, well-built, and remarkably comfortable, with a low back and relatively short body. Its smaller size lends itself well to a fingertip grip, but small and medium-sized hands will also find it comfortable with a palm or a claw grip. It also comes with a unique charging station that acts as a receiver range extender for better performance. The Razer Viper Ultimate's build quality is excellent. Although it's very lightweight and entirely made of plastic, it feels durable and well-built. There's no wobble or gaps, but the left and right buttons squeak when you press them down. The clicks feel sturdy and slightly different from what you get in most mice, probably due to the optical switches. Best Wired Corsair Sabre RGB Pro The Corsair Sabre RGB Pro is an excellent wired gaming mouse. It has a comfortable right-handed shape and a solid plastic body with a slight texture for added grip. It's lightweight, feels well-built, and has a very low click latency. It also has two independent RGB lighting zones, a flexible cable, good mouse feet, and companion software for customization compatible with Windows and Mac OS. Its CPI has a wide range that you can adjust by increments of one, but those with smaller hands may not be able to reach all the buttons using a claw or fingertip grip. This mouse is also one of the first to offer an 8000 Hz maximum polling rate, which should provide more fluid feeling mouse movements, though this isn't something we currently test. The Corsair Sabre Pro's build quality feels excellent. The left and right clicks have good feedback, and there's no flex in the body. However, if you shake the mouse, there's a rattling sound, and the side buttons feel a bit squishy. Best Ultralight Glorious Model O The Glorious Model O is an excellent ultralight gaming mouse that feels very well built and solid, with a honeycomb pattern design that places it among the lightest mice we've tested. This wired-only model comes with an outstanding cable that's lightweight and flexible, and all of them are easily programmable within the companion software. The sensor's performance is also excellent, with a wide CPI range that's pretty consistent whether you move the cursor slowly or quickly, and a low click latency. It has a very comfortable ambidextrous design, suitable for any grip style. However, its large body isn't well suited for people with smaller hands who may feel more comfortable using the Glorious Model O, a smaller version that performs similarly. This mouse feels very well built and solid, and while it's all made of plastic, it doesn't have any gaps or squeaking parts. However, the scroll wheel may sometimes be problematic as the rubber moves but not the wheel itself, causing delays when scrolling. It's also worth noting that the honeycomb pattern holes will likely let dust into the exposed circuit board, though we aren't sure if this will affect long-term durability. Best Budget Logitech G203 Light Sync The Logitech G203 Light Sync is an excellent wired gaming mouse. It feels very well built and it has a very low click latency. It also has a wide CPI range, and you can adjust the set CPI by increments of 50. It isn't ideal for larger hands using a palm or claw grip, but it should be comfortable for all hand sizes using a fingertip grip. It has RGB lighting zones in the logo and three independent zones in a band around the back. The companion software offers plenty of customization options, and it's compatible with Windows and Mac OS. Unfortunately, while its predecessor, the Logitech G203 Prodigy, has onboard memory, this mouse doesn't. You can play comfortably and with total control. The classic and straightforward six button layout and classic gaming shape is a comfortable time tested and loved design. Each button can be customized using Logitech G Hub software to simplify tasks. Thanks for watching. If you liked what you saw, then hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you loved it. 
take a moment to hit the bell icon so you'll get notified of all our new latest uploads.